Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Miriam. I am a medium to people, pets, and the paranormal. Every Monday we do our pick a card. Every Wednesday we receive information from our power animals. And every Friday is your channeled message. Um, my job is to help you create, uh, intuitively navigate your day, your week, your hours, um, and to make help you make better choices by having that intuition um, to guide you along the way. And your job is to find a daily meditative practice to enhance the work I give you and then one day not need me and be able to make these decisions yourself, to be able to see the intuition and feel the intuition the way that I do so that you don't need anybody else because what I do, everybody has within them. So we're gonna look at our channeled message today specifically for you guys. Um, what is it that spirit wants you to know to help you continue to navigate through health, love, career, um, personal? We want you to know that you're stronger more often than you're weak. You're smart more often than you're ignorant. And you're powerful beyond your wildest imagination. But tapping into that power is so unusual. It is so uncomfortable. And those of you that have tuned in, it's because you have been seeking a way to tap into that power. You want to, you know it's there, but you have no idea how to grab it. And the way you grab it is by opening your heart. The way you grab it is by realizing that you are spirit first, that you are no matter which body you incarnate or come in through, you are spirit first and spirit holds all that power. And to tap into who you are spirit first requires a meditation practice or a yoga practice. But for those of you today, you have to remember that more often than not, you're utilizing your power on some level. And when I say power, I'm not saying power over somebody or power being better than somebody. I'm saying, you use your strength, you use your intuition, you use your courage more often than you think you do. Now, where and how that can develop you into someone who you feel makes better choices and who you feel can be in better relationships, whether it's professional or personal, that is going to be the road that you have to drive down yourself, right? So that means going within, finding out um, why you make the choices you make. Some of that is very simple psychology 101 and some of that is more in depth that you find in a meditation practice or yoga practice. But as we work on who we are, as we start to kind of chip away and open up our heart and open up our courage, we can start to delve deeper into why we're here and what am I supposed to get from being here? So most importantly, your message for today, your channeled message is to remember that you are stronger more often than you're weak. We get caught up in our weaknesses and we obsess over our weaknesses and we believe that we are only our weaknesses. But you forget how often you make choices based out of strength. The same thing applies with feeling and being smart. You're smarter more often than you're ignorant. You make good choices more often than you don't, but you obsess over the bad choices. And so being able to see that you are more than just a couple of bad choices, you are those smart choices that you make more often than not. And then that leads you to your power, knowing that you are more powerful, but you don't recognize when you utilize your power because you don't utilize your power very often. And your power is your creative source, your intuitive source, it comes from the gut. That power means you have combined your head brain, your heart brain, and your gut brain. And so when we are able to bring those three together, our gut brain, our head brain, and our heart brain, that's when we're powerful because we're using our intuition and we're using our logic and we're using our compassion to make choices that are best, not only for us, but for those around us as well. Remember to subscribe and I will see you on Monday for our pick a card.